So, you want a cat but live in an apartment? No problem. Many cat breeds can adapt to living indoors, but I've selected the ones that do best. The cats on this list don't typically need catios or leash walks to be happy, and most have a medium to low energy level. If one of them sparks your interest, don't worry, as I have dedicated videos on most of these breeds. Make sure to check the description box. Number 1. The Russian Blue Previously called the Archangel Cat, this reserved, moderately affectionate kitty is great for apartments. The Russian Blue is easily startled and does just fine without experiencing the outdoors. Russian Blues are playful, but not overly energetic. They're super loyal and somewhat independent kitties, being an excellent choice for busy people. Number 2. The British Shorthair British cats are typically mellow and easygoing. They're medium to large cats and are gifted with charming personalities. They're affectionate, playful, and like to keep to themselves from time to time. Plus, they're renowned for their big and loud purrs. British cats are usually docile and well-mannered kitties, and it's highly unlikely they'll become mischievous. Number 3. The Sphinx this cat has trouble regulating its body temperature and must be kept indoors. But make no mistake, as the Sphinx is anything but a couch potato. This cat is not only incredibly playful and active, it's also super affectionate and cuddly. They need to have enough space to run around and plenty of furniture to climb on. For these reasons, Sphinx kitties are best suited for people who spend a lot of time at home and live in a medium to large apartments. Number 4. The Scottish Group Besides the Scottish Fold, which is pretty problematic. This group includes the Scottish Strait and their long-haired versions. All Scottish cats have similar temperaments regardless of their looks. These soft-spoken kitties form strong bonds with their people and get along well with children and other pets. Scottish cats don't need much exercise and are easily adaptable. Be aware of the fold varieties, as they're prone to developing bone-related deformities, which I talk about in these videos. Number 5. The European Short Hair and the European Long Hair also known as the typical house cats. Though not a breed, most regular house cats can be kept indoors. These cats are typically adaptable without being overly active. They're much cheaper than pedigree cats, and they love you just the same. They're also incredibly easy to find, so please consider visiting your local shelter if you want a cat. It's a much-needed help for these kitties, especially since millions are put to sleep every year. Number 6. The Ragdoll and the Ragamuffin Don't be fooled by these cats' large size. Most ragdolls and ragamuffins are low-energy cats after they reach maturity. And while they're known to enjoy leash walks, they're just as happy indoors. The Ragdoll and the Ragamuffin are closely related and have similar temperaments. They're mellow, easygoing, and don't need much exercise. Still, they're not suited for small apartments. Like the Sphinx, they hate being alone, a crucial aspect to consider. Number 7. The Persian Group there are quite a few cat breeds in this group, as you can see on the screen. However, all of them share the same personality traits. These cats are typically mellow, affectionate, and love nothing more than to chill in a comfy place. Near their human parents, of course. Persian kitties like staying out of trouble, and with their short bursts of energy are incredibly cute and entertaining. Unfortunately, their health isn't their strongest suit, a topic I discuss in this video. Number 8. The Munchkin This short but lively cat is definitely a sight to remember. Even though their health was scrutinized in the past, munchkins don't appear to be problematic. Still, not every short-legged cat is a munchkin. Only the pedigree can attest to that. Moving on, the munchkin cannot jump as high as other kitties, but that doesn't stop this cat from enjoying life. The munchkin is pretty active, playful, and loves to be the center of attention. Number 9. The Berman this is one of the most laid-back cat breeds in the world. These fluffy, medium-sized cats have a moderate to low energy level. Berman cats get along with anyone and are great for busy people. Moreover, they're super easy to groom despite their long fur. You can watch my video about Berman cats to learn why. Number 10. The American Shorthair This breed is known for its iconic silver tabby and black stripes look. It comes in many colors and patterns. It's sweet-tempered and highly adaptable. American Shorthairs have a moderate activity level, are affectionate but not clingy, and do well even as a single cat. Their short fur makes this breed extremely easy to care for, and their adaptability makes them perfect for almost anyone. Number 11. The Selkirk Rex this curly beauty is just as docile as a ragdoll, being more of a couch potato. The Selkirk Rex is a fantastic option if you want a unique-looking cat. They're affectionate and loyal cats, always happy to cuddle. They do great with other pets and children alike. And they actually prefer to have a four-legged companion rather than being alone.
Number 12. The Chartreuse Chartreuse cats are a rare French breed known for their woolly blue coats and smiling faces. They're highly adaptable and super laid back. Chartreuse cats are gifted with soft voices, but often no sound comes out when they open their mouths to meow. They also have incredibly soft and plush coats, perfect for snuggling. And now, if you're about to get your first cat ever, I highly suggest watching this video next. You can also check the description to learn more about the breeds mentioned here. See you next time!